Okay, this is the One Whole Designer Tutorial Series, uh, episode 32. This episode is going to be dealing with uh, shoals, or at least uh, I think they're shoals. I'm not really sure what else to call them. Um, if you have been uh, watching this series, you may notice this is a different location than what we have been using. Um, this is a course I submitted previously, White Knuckle Beach. This is not a plug for my course, um, but this is a great example of what this video is going to be dealing with, I think. Um, you'll notice I have these rocks um, along the coastline. It gives it kind of a cool, uh, jagged, beachy type look. Um, I've had a, a couple people comment on them. I haven't really seen them on a whole bunch of other courses, so um, I was going to show you really quickly how to do them. So um, if this is a look you want, this is what that video is about. Or this video is about. <clears throat> so we'll exit back out. I'll remind myself how pretty that is. When this finally comes back up, we'll get started. Um, so we'll go into this uh, this lake here. Um, to get that, that kind of rocky look, um, I like using this tool. What we're going to do is we're going to take it down to just an inch so that the ground is barely visible uh, under the water. Um, you want to drag and apply um, to any area that you want to be affected by this rocks. Uh, what this is doing is the rocks and the grass are going to auto-populate on this ground um, and it's going to be barely low enough that it's going to stick out of the water there. Um, so now we've kind of got it where we're at here. We're going to go back up to um, rocks and raise those up. Um, and then once we do, it's going to auto-populate rocks there. Kind of shoaly and beachy and there should be some grass popping up a couple places here too, but I guess not. Um, that's it. And that's pretty simple. Um, I recommend using this um, along the beach. It really look uh, okay in that lake, um, but alongside the, the beach that I had for a second ago, I think it actually looks pretty cool. You want is um, I really recommend that, that negative, um, negative one inch there. That gets it low from the water that it's separate so you can't really see it. Um, then if you get too close to the water level, it gets kind of glitchy. There, It kind of burns almost, um, and it just doesn't look good. So um, as it is right now, none of this is shimmering. It looks very clean, um, and you got that nice rocky look. So um, if that's something interesting, that's how you do it. Till the next video.